Heavenly Father, Ahia, Father, we give you glory, honor, and praise, and we lift up and extol your holy name, Father. We bow before you, Lord, and we exalt you as the God of all creation. We thank you for our Savior, our Mashiach, Yeshia. We thank you, Lord, that he is the manifested image of your name, Father. Thank you that the living breath of your spirit, the Holy Spirit, Ruach HaKodesh, Heavenly Father, that you all, Heavenly Father, have imparted a measure of your presence unto us. And we want to come today, Heavenly Father, praying with the confidence spoken of in 1 John 5 and 14, that we have this confidence that whatever we ask, whatever we petition, you're going to answer that according to your will, Heavenly Father. You're going to answer it because we ask in faith and we believe. And I just want to come today to lift up the men in this generation. Heavenly Father, and our boys, Heavenly Father, the males of the family, because we know, Father, that the enemy is after the male children because they keep the lineage going. They keep the bloodline going, Heavenly Father, and we want to break this generational curse of death, Heavenly Father the things that the enemy has tried to do to kill off the men, Heavenly Father, so that households are not whole anymore. So that whatever, Father, you have destined for the curse breakers of each family to do, the enemy is trying to kill them. Just as Herod tried to kill Holy Ashaya when he was born, just as the firstborn males were being slaughtered, before they even knew their purpose, before they even knew who they were. And we just want to come against that today, Lord, because we can see, Lord, that you are raising up kings and queens in this hour but we know that you are calling the men back to their rightful position heavenly father in your kingdom in the household in their lives you're giving them their lives back you're giving them the understanding of who they are in you and we want to pray a hedge of protection around them as fathers heavenly father teaching sons to be men heavenly father godly men heavenly father strong and devout men in the lord And so before we go into this prayer, Heavenly Father, we just lift you up as the Almighty, knowing that you have the power to do all things, that nothing is impossible with you, and that all things are possible, Heavenly Father, because you are God Almighty. So we want to come and we want to place over ourselves, our homes, the men in our family, spouses, children, sons, brothers, uncles, nephews, Heavenly Father, cousins, whatever relation or connection we want to intercede on their behalf. And on our behalf, Heavenly Father, we put on the full armor of Yah. We gird our loins about with truth and we put on the breastplate of righteousness. We shod our feet with the gospel of peace. Above of all we take the shield of faith wherewith we shall be able to quench all the fiery darts of the wicked and we take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit which is the word of a high end. and heavenly father we come interceding we petition the courts of heaven lord to bring a lockdown right now against the forces of darkness coming against the men in this generation heavenly father we call on the blood of Yeshua Hamashiach Jesus Christ of Nazareth to command these entities principalities spiritual wickedness in high places to cease and desist now at the name of Jesus. Every knee will bow and every tongue confess. We come with the breaker anointing of Micah 2 and 13 to break every family curse, Heavenly Father. We ask you right now, Father, with the key of David, we place the cloak of invisibility over our minds and their minds, body, spirit, and heart. We seal us all in Holy Shia's blood. Heavenly Father, we come before your throne boldly today to obtain mercy and help help in the time of our need heavenly father we ask you to bring total destruction to this wicked generational curse of suicide and death and the robbery of one's life and we command it right now to seize fall down and die now in jesus holy name with the key of david and the sound of my voice I shatter and dissolve this demonic curse to pieces and rip its talons away, Heavenly Father, along with any demonic principality, chief ruler, spirit, archon, demon, a fallen angel assigned over our husband, our sons, our nephews, our brothers, our uncles, cousins, any male in any part of our family, Heavenly Father. We just decree right now 
that this will not continue, Heavenly Father, in their lives, that these principalities no longer have this authority. We strip them of this authority now using the key of David, which is the anointing and the authority given unto us through Christ Yeshua in us. Heavenly Father, their lives will no longer be taken and death will no longer be caused. Suicide will no longer be attached to their lives. Father, we ask in Holy Yeshua's name that you thrust it out now and I command it to cease and desist now in Jesus' mighty name. We interrupt this evil work and command it to halt now by the power of the blood of the Lamb. Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, we drag every principality, every evil ruler, spirit, demonic entity, witch, warlock, witch, doctor, wizard, every ounce of spell work, witchcraft, and all forms of voodoo, hexes, vexes, magic, enchantments, incantation, every evil work associated with this generational curse. We relentlessly drag them to the courts of heaven to make our appeal and petition for it to be utterly destroyed and dismantled in Yeshua HaMashiach's mighty name. We plead with you father higher to make our petition known before you today according to first john 5 and 14 and this is the confidence that we have in him that if we ask anything according to his will he heareth us and if we know that he hear us whatsoever we ask we know that we have the petition that we desired of him father we know that you visit the iniquity of the fathers to the third and fourth generation and that the blood of the lamb has paid in full the price for every sin i stand in intercessory through this prayer to ask your forgiveness forgiveness for the sins of the family heavenly father the males in the family heavenly father that have given the enemy legal right to carry out this act we ask the blood of the lamb to reach back into the ancestral bloodline to find the very source of this curse to expose the culprit the expose the curse and the culprit heavenly father the demonic spirit that concocted this contract i ask in the name of yeshua hamashiach Jesus Christ of Nazareth, that the blood of the Lamb wash away the sin of the ancestral family member or members who may have made covenant with this agreement, Heavenly Father, knowing or unknowingly. We ask that the blood of Holy Yeshua speaks better than things than the blood of Abel. So we petition that the blood of the Lamb speak now and expunge you can add in their names specifically right now in the prayer begin to call out their names specifically call them by name in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach and all generations thereafter expunge their names today and deactivate this curse on their behalf for your glory in Yeshua HaMashiach's mighty name the blood of the lamb we call upon you holy spirit Break and dismantle the altars built concerning all blood sacrifices to feed the strength and power of this wicked curse. Uproot and tear down their entire system implemented against the males in our family today in the name of Jesus by the power of his blood. Blood of the lamb, wash away any trace of this contract in hell, in the second heaven. Rip it to shreds by your power now in Jesus' holy name. Father, higher, we ask that you completely demolish, crush, and thrust out all demonic hosts and the devil himself away from my husband's bloodline and that these evil hosts be bound hand and foot, chain and fetter into the pits of hell and may the heat be raised a thousand times harder to afflict them because of the pain and affliction that has been brought against our, the males in our family in Yeshua HaMashiach's holy name. Arrest them now with the law of your spirit, with your presence. Arrest them by the spirit now, Heavenly Father, and loose restoration, healing, peace, and fullness of joy in place of the hurt, the sickness that, that has befallen anyone associated with these curses, Heavenly Father. And as a side effect or a hidden clause in this curse, I bring the finished work of the cross today to sign, seal, deliver this prayer before our Father in heaven according to the authority given unto me in the book of Esther. We stamp it before the king with his signet ring and scepter and decree it according to Job 22 and 28. You shall decree a thing and it shall be established and the light shall shine upon thy ways. We call it done, approved, and manifested by the power in the name of Yeshua HaMashiach. We also call for heavenly hosts and angelic reinforcements from the third heaven that sit around your throne, Father, to be dispatched and released to protect our homes and to cover us from any retaliation due to the nature and the power and the manifestation and the victory of this prayer by the power given unto us in Luke 10 and 19 we forbid any further action or harm against 
anyone associated with this prayer, Father. I pray that the angels of heaven be sent to minister to the men of our family, Heavenly Father, the bloodline, and protect and filter and block their ears and eyes from any whispers of the enemy through any and all outlets by subtlety of the enemy. I speak release of blessing, Heavenly Father. I speak and release the blessing of life more abundantly through Christ Yeshua, Heavenly Father. And may the men in our family, in our bloodline, Heavenly Father, become generational curse breakers to teach the men in the generations to come. May you restore completely and fill every void within them that has been afflicted by any curses of death heavenly father may their power be broken now by the power of the blood of jesus heavenly father may you turn it around right now heavenly father with the power of the holy ghost may you strengthen and heal in the name of yashia hamashik by the power of the blood we speak a father heavenly father that if anything is close to your voice close to your will close to your power that it be open now according to mark 7 33 through 34 heavenly father open the eyes and ears of the spirit heavenly father and restore every bodily function anything heavenly father that may be affected to cause one to die to take one's own life i just decree that it will return back to the perfect design of christ right now heavenly father in the mighty name of yashiah hamashiach and that the very inkling of illness cause heavenly father be removed in his holy name with his stripes we are healed we believe it in faith in the holy yashiah's name i pray this prayer with great faith so be it and it is so amen